As we work to rebound, many businesses are getting creative to keep their employees on the job. That's right, and the Franklin Theater is bringing movies back to the big screen and smiles back to faces. News Channel 5's Hannah McDonald tells us about their phased reopening in tonight's We're Open, y'all. For a year, the Franklin Theater has been waiting in the wings for COVID-19 to run its course, but now the theater is reopening with a limited schedule, but plenty of these seats to go around. I think it's going to feel like a very exclusive and um, VIP experience in here. Date night, movie night, or your girl's night out can involve some time in the Franklin Theater starting next month. We feel like with the vaccination rate increasing and the transmission rate in the community coming down, that we feel strongly that we can begin to reopen in a phased way. The theater will not sell all 279 seats at first. 80 spaced out seats will be available when films, food and drinks return in April. When we have visitors in this facility, they're in here for two or three hours sometimes, which that exposure level is different than walking into a store. Um, so that's why our reopening has been different than our neighbors. The theater went dark at the start of the pandemic. On Main Street, it is one of the last mainstays to reopen. We have so many, um, you know, retailers and other downtown Franklin merchants that are our neighbors, but our business is just a slightly different. In May, they hope to resume live entertainment and by July, open up more seats. We understand the economic impact that the Franklin Theater and our signature festivals have in this area, and we're really excited to be able to bring that vitality back. In Franklin, Hannah McDonald, News Channel 5. So looking forward to it. Now, the full April schedule is not finalized yet. Just uh, to see what's on the calendar, visit the box office Friday through Sunday, or you can keep checking the theater's website.